Hey, what's going on, people? Thanks for joining in. You really seem to like this series, so I brought you today some exciting facts about the products from the Apiary. If you enjoyed this, don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. Let's get going. Okay, wax comb. It's something that the queen bee produces in the apiary, and although they're similar to honeycombs, they do not produce honey, simply because they are the base structure that holds the honey droplets in place. They serve two main functions. Firstly, you can take nine wax combs and craft them into wax comb blocks, which serves aesthetically purposes as building blocks and storage for massive amounts of wax comb. Secondly, you can insert wax comb into a presser and create pressed wax, the last being used in creation of armor and candles. Honeycomb is obtained from the queen bee in the apiary, and this is a wax comb that has the honey droplets in its hollows. When inserted in the presser, they produce pure honey and pressed wax. This is worth mentioning that when you put a wax comb into the presser, they produce two pressed waxes. While putting a honeycomb, it will result in receiving only one pressed wax and one honey. Last but not least, bee grubs are produced in the apiary and are stackable items, but they don't have any other use than being cooked as meat item. So just throw them into a furnace and enjoy the one shank or two hunger that refills. They may be used in some recipes that accept any meat. However, they're not specifically required for any recipe. The most important thing that you get out from the apiary and honeycombs in general is honey. With it, you can make recipes like snacks all the way up to large meals. Honey and sugar are, for the most part, substitutes to each other, though there are some recipes that will specifically call for honey, so keep that in mind. That's gonna wrap it up, and if you'd like to see more, check out the upper right corner for the first part, and the upper left corner for the survival series. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.